Hello, I'm Claw for Gaming, and welcome to my channel. This is my first Yokai Watch video, and I'm gonna talk about the new Yokai design, which I'm kind of iffy about, but let's just start. So here's the Jabanyan light side and old design. So the new Jabanyan is pretty cool looking. I like how he's got defined fur as well. I do prefer the older design because it is cute. Cute. Also, Jabanyan has fingers and some shorter tails, smaller head and ears, is a bit taller and has more cat-like pupils. Hello pupils, I'm ready to speak to you. We are going to learn about Yokai Watch. Um, anyways, let's move on. So here's Jabanyan's shadow side. Well, he got scary. Demonish eyes, a bit more slender, even has claws. Kind of like me. <laughs> but he's ready to battle. I'm also curious about Thornyon and Badly. Now for Komasan light side and old design. I do prefer the old Komasan design because it is adorable. Adorable. But I do like how Komasan is very calm as it is deep in thought, which is really cool. Also, he's more dog like in this design, which is cool because he is a lion dog. But when he goes to shadow type form, let's find out. So here's the Komasan shadow side. So now it's a lion talking about the lion dog thing from the floor. Also, about that calmness, it is gone. It is nowhere to be seen. But that battle stance is awesome. Hmm, what's gonna happen with Komei? Now for Whisper, new and old design. Surprisingly, I really like the new design. Now it looks more like an actual butler, as used to be Nate's, Nate's yokai butler. I'm willing to bet he's actually learned a thing or two about yokai over 30 years and no longer needs the silly yokai pad. I really like the tuxedo and the hair. Now for Mickey, Mitchy, and Slime Amanda. Mitchy is the new name for Slime Amanda, apparently. Hilarious how you, he looks like a superhero, even though he used to be the first boss yokai, aka okay, bad, unbefriendable yokai that you fight in like the first game. Now for Mitchy Shadow, Mitchy Shadow Side. This design is definitely more reminiscent of Slime Amanda. I like how he's a very uh, vibrant purple. He's very cool looking. There. Yeah. Also has some pretty nice spikes on his back and some pretty nice sharp. Bang! Now for Blazing on Light Side and Old Design. I am a bit confused on why a Blazing Lion looks, um, calm. But Confusion aside, I do like the new design, so I do still prefer the old one again. It seems, in this design at least, he's not fixated on winning every single thing in existence. Well, let's move on. Now for Blazing on Shadow Side. Okay, maybe I was wrong before. In this design, he's definitely gonna win everything in existence, especially wrestling, because he's that is one muscular lion. <laughs> My gosh, she sure has a blazing heart. I don't want to be around when he gets crazy, unless he already is. Then I'm out of here. <laughs> now for Blazaria, Light Side, and Old Design. Again, 
I prefer the more cute design. But the new design is more accurate. Is more accurate. Accurate. To the yokai it's based on. I am curious though about what they're planning with Frostina. Also, guys, quick note on what I forgot to mention with Whisper. I wonder what they're doing with Buchanyan. I mean, Ibanyan and Whisper got new design, so what's gonna happen with uh, Buchanyan? Yeah. Now for Lazaria Shadow Side. Well, that got kind of creepy. Looks like an Ice Witch of sorts. It's really cool looking though. No pun intended. <laughs> now for QB Light Side and Old Design. I have the same confusion as Blaze on. And the one I forgot to mention the confusion about. Mitchy, aka Slime Amander. Yubi does look really cool though, with a certain element of calmness. Now for Chubi Shadow Side. This is more related to the old design, more feral, which is very cool. Or more like burning and blazing hot. Also, this ultimate for this thing is Inferno. So, I think we can be. I think we can tell that it's fire related. And it also looks very ready to battle. Well, I would never battle it myself. I would send out my um, yokai friend or something. That's most likely what would happen. Now for Hungramp's light side and old design. Not much change over 30 years besides being taller and opening his eyes, which are kind of goofy looking. Yes, he also has a bowl too, which is kind of funny. I'll give you some food. Wait, is Hongorge here? I want to give him some food. It's like the evolution. Now for Hongram's shadow side. Oh my! Boy, that escalated quickly. Indeed. Did he chomp on his own head lump? It looks very chewed, my goodness. Also, he's got a lot of drool. And I wonder how many souls he's eaten. Probably what he, he does. He probably eats Onis. Kind of like, um, Demuncher. So, uh, what do you guys think of the new design? Do you think any other yokai should get this new design variation? Make sure to comment below and I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching!